I'm Simon Chen, uh, one of the exile pro-democracy activists for Hong Kong, and now it based in the UK. I'm one of those who have been now in exile overseas. We are seeing that if we can rebuild the new diaspora of Hong Kong communities, then we can rebuild the checks and balance. And we want to give a very positive message to our fellow to our compatriots, that we should not give up for human rights, that we should, we should look forward. But one day, we should be entitled to back to our hometown. But the condition is, with democracy, with freedom, with human rights, and without fear. Back to many years when I was still a high school student, I watched the documentary by the public broadcaster of Hong Kong, RTHK, and mentioned about the human rights lawyers in China. I, I cried several times that time. I feel very, very touching. From that moment, I care about human rights. This kind of thing I feel is not just about coincidence, but it's a destiny. I would totally not surprise why I've why been detained afterwards. Well, I feel once that you stand against the very powerful authoritarian regime, there's almost no sense of safety to the person and to any citizens. Um, so that's why I feel I've been very mentally prepared that you should prepare the worst scenario case. That is really, really a very serious question in our mind that whether and to, to how far and to what extent that you, should, you could live up to your values and principle to safeguard that. Um, risk is all, almost there, always there. Even though I'm in central London, several times I've been feeling I'm being followed, I'm being monitored. But bit by bit, you know you're doing a right thing. That's why you take that risk. That is not cheap, but that is priceless. That's based on lots of people's sacrifice. Well, I wish that um, the United Nations and the international community, community to keep focusing and keep caring about those people who have been illegally, unjustifiably uh, detained and imprisoned out in Hong Kong. And that is about human life, that is about human being, and that's about humanity. That's the UN chapter.